welcome to Christy's Stampin' Spot. I'm Christy, an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator, and we are about to do our um, part two of um, the 21-22 um, annual catalog walkthrough. So our new one, and <clears throat> I'm very excited. There's so much awesome stuff in here today. Let me go ahead and get started, and let me turn you guys down. Let's see here. Do, do, do. Thing. Yay! So if you missed yesterday, it's, it's not it's not just on Facebook. It's actually also up on my YouTube channel. So you guys can look for part one where we went over the first part of the catalog, the first 28 pages. Oh my gosh, here it is. Oh, so much awesomeness. Okay. So again, I need to remember to keep in, um, a lookout for these the catalog icons that tell us um, the things about is going on in this catalog. So let's turn it. Do, do, do. So we went up to the fabulous um, Friends Like Seashells bundle yesterday, and today is the Pansy Petals. Oh my gosh, this is such a gorgeous, 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 gorgeous um, set of DSP designer series paper. And the bundle, so beautiful, so pretty. Okay, let me, let me scoot this this way so we can get this up. There we go. Where we have, you can see all my stuff. <gasps> so pretty. Okay, so the first thing I want to show you guys, um, here is a beautiful card that um, my, um, I don't want to say my accountability partner, some of my um, fellow demonstrators, she, um, Look at that, that's like her customer card this month. Isn't that gorgeous? That's the oval punch. And she used the images from the pansy patch. And I love how she did the inside. Isn't that gorgeous? Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. And she used those those new jewel in jewels, that beautiful ribbon. Isn't that pretty? So pretty. And then I also made these. And these are actually up on my blog today. And I made these cute little tags with the tailor tags. And like I said, if you go on to my um, up onto my uh, website today, you can find um, the PDFs at the very bottom of the post, where you have this one that has without the pictures, um, but they also have the ones with the pictures, the, the supply list, and how I made these, which is pretty awesome. So you can go ahead and get that, and that's for free on today's blog, which is awesome. So I used with these, so I actually just used the thank you from this gorgeous set. This is a beautiful, beautiful photopolymer set. And um, what's awesome is it has, so this side I actually took them off and put them on here. But you see I didn't on this side. So on the newer um, photopolymer, they actually have these beautiful, they actually put the, um, the images on the, they're all like on the inside of this case so that they're reversed. So look at that. So you can set them here, which is super nice. I know I don't I don't store my dies with my stamp set. But for those that do, just make sure you leave your um if you put them in here like this, make sure you leave your plastic hard piece in between it to keep it safe from your dies. But oh my goodness. So pretty. This is such a beautiful, beautiful set. And at first I wasn't sure. There's a lot of little pieces. Um oh my gosh, it makes such beautiful, beautiful things. Love, love, love. So is that awesome? If it right there, so now you'll know, you can really tell if there is something missing or not, which is pretty awesome. So it's a double, that's two of them, which is nice. Oops, I think it's stuck under here. That way again. So very pretty, and it has some beautiful sentiments. It's a great happy birthday and a thank you. And the thank you is actually the one that I used on this um, tag. Isn't that pretty? If I hold it just right, so it, there we go. And then um, I actually to use to make these tags, I use one of our new tailor made tags. And this is a fabulous set of dies. Um, and they have two different tag tops, like the flat edge or the round edge. And then it also has these cute little, um, what are they called? Like the, they're like hole protectors or um, the layers to go around the hole. So pretty, so pretty. So to make these, I used these new tags. And again, I, show, I think I showed you guys where those are on the back yesterday. But um, 
I use the fabulous uh, Pansy, I think it's called Pansy, Petal, Pansy Petals um, BSB, and then this is the Shimmer Vellum. Let me show you guys the BSB. This is my favorite paper. So beautiful, so beautiful. So the colors that are in this D DSP are um, Blackberry Bliss, Bumblebee, Calypso Coral, Evening Evergreen, Fresh Freesia, Pale Papaya, Polished Pink, Soft Sea Foam, Soft Succulent, and Whisper White. So that is that gorgeous pack. Remember the 12 by 12, that's 24 sheets, two of each. So these are the pretty pink. So this is the um, that I actually use to make um, my tags. And, and if you love gingham, there's so much beautiful gingham in this. This one has like a little flower pattern. You can see that? It's pretty. It's that bumblebee. There's a gingham and the soft succulent. And there's some soft succulent and um, evening evergreen leaves. That, and those leaves are um, with the dyes. I should pull out the dyes. I should pull the dyes out so that they're out while I go through this paper. Because it cuts out some of the stuff. So here are the beautiful dies. And you can see there's lots of, of fabulous little pieces. But you can see these um, will cut out these leaves right here. You see that? I move it up and then it falls down. So you can cut all these up. It would be a little time consuming, but you could totally do it. Totally do it. But it does both of these. I can't do it with it that far up. Do -do -do. There we go. And then this one does the fat one. The little shorty one. See that? Sweet. Awesome sauce. Okay. And then there's the pretty gingham. And here's a, of the Fresh Fraser gingham. And there's some little flowers. Super pretty. The um, polka dot, and then oh, here's the big pa um, pansies, and again these cut out. So you can cut those out with your die cuts, which is super awesome. Do, and so what I do when they're, they're this tight is I will use my paper snips to snip around like a, to make a, um, around the white right here. Um, and then I'll just run that through my um, machine so that I can get the most out of it without having to do too much fussy cutting. But um, that way I don't, instead of just using my paper um, trimmer, I, I don't want to cut any of those uh, flowers. I want to get them all, get them all out. And then here's a gorgeous bold stripe. That's really pretty. And then here's, um, some more pretty flowers. Look how gorgeous. It's a really pretty. And then another piece of gingham. That looks like the pale papaya. And it has the same as it looks a lot like it's this one is the smaller and then there's the larger and it's got a little bee. Super cute, super cute. Super fabulous. Put those away. And then although I think there are they are right now on back order. Um oh, We'll be getting some in soon. But they this with this wheat also has bees. It's little gold bees. Look how cute these are. They're so super cute. Like the ladybugs with the dragonfly um, ones last time. These are little gold. Little gold bees. Oh, they're so super cute. So I can't wait till those are back in stock. You guys can get a bunch of those, which is pretty awesome. And then if you can tell I made this shimmery, I used um this is the shim the new shimmer vellum which is pretty gorgeous. I really love this new vellum. And you can find it in the back on page, um, do, 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 I have it in here, right here, page 135, right here is the vellum. Um, and it is um, officially the 2021, 2023 in color shimmer vellum. And oh my goodness, so I have, like I said, a PDF for um, these tags, and I forgot to put the ink color. I just did the 2023, the Shimmer Vellum, and so I had to go back and re, like, read to my PDF to write the right um, thing. But anyway, it's two each of each color. And these are absolutely gorgeous. Super gorgeous. So 
me show you guys. So it is the 12 by 12, which is pretty awesome. And it is, it's about the same thickness. I was going to pull out a piece of, I actually had a piece of the vellum. There's a little piece of the vellum right here. So the vellum, this is the vellum cardstock. So it feels like it's about the same uh, as your vellum cardstock. But because the cardstock is 8.5 by 11, it just feels like it's a lot more. Can you guys see how the shimmer, you guys catch that shimmer? It's so pretty. So that's the Evening Evergreen. The Fresh Freesia, which is what I used on our, um, on my uh, tags. So pretty. So pretty. And then here's, um, this is the Pale Papaya. And the Soft Succulent. You can really tell the difference between the Soft Succulent when you put it on the Evening Evergreen. Is it pretty? So pretty. And then, of course, the polished pink. Awesome. So it is one-sided. So um, but, oh, it's really pretty. And it is a little, it's vellum, so it is see-through. But oh, my goodness. The shimmer is just so gorgeous on this stuff. So gorgeous. Like I said, you can find it on page 135. Um, and it you get two sheets of 12. So um, that's an awesome amount. It, it's great. I, I'm really excited. <laughs> to use that more and more so not not a 12 it's of the five so it's 10 sheets right because it's the two uh yeah 10 sheets two of each color super pretty i do love the stitched stitch really in right now all of our stuff is all those fabulous stitch stuff so anyway okay so that is i think i showed you guys the dyes and the paper and samples so cute oh and then you notice this black baker's twine. We actually have new twine. Oh, oh the girl was actually uh, on. <laughs> She's asking about lunch. Yes, you can get lunch. <laughs> she actually is um, gotten her all of her COVID shots, and we actually were going to meet a friend. So pretty. Oh, so pretty. So pretty. Anyway, like I was saying, they have twine. This is the baker's twine essential pack. So. You get um, 10 yards of of these two and then five yards of these. I actually have that on the um, on my website where I have that written down. But isn't that cool? So we can get all these fabulous twine. And that's the black, the basic black that I used on here. And did I show you guys the back? I fussy cut the little, um, is the other one back in here? Yeah. The little images and put them on the back. That cool i love 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 those are so pretty so pretty so pretty so it works really nice that black especially brings out because this black um the black background for those for that gorgeous um paper the dsp designer series paper is so pretty so if you notice though it doesn't um show you the designer series paper on here so we have our colors our main colors um, and then they show you a piece of the of the DSP here, and that it cuts those two pieces out. Um, but again, the dies are in the back, and I like I showed you yesterday. We have you, you'll, you'll find it in the die because this is a new set. See the little the little pink N for the new. Um, it will be in that first section of the dies, which are the die bundles, and that's where you'll find. Um, dies and I went right past it to do right here with different samples and then the paper though um, the designer series paper is also in a different place right here so and that starts on page 130 that you can see the designer series paper so there was the beauty of earth that we looked at yesterday and the pansy petals is on page 130 132 right here. You guys can find that. The bottom right there. It'll end the new, although all of our designer series paper is new except for the in good case. But anyway, that's where you can find the paper in the back. So our layout's a little bit different. I know that they wanted to to actually make our um, our annual catalog a little smaller so it was easier to ship. And then our mini catalogs are going to be much bigger. So um, that's and then this is also a distinctive. So I forgot to do, show you guys those yesterday. I mean, I showed you that you have to look for the icons. I forgot to show you the icon. So this one's got the distinctive, which means it's like the photo, um, photo quality, photographic quality. 
it's gorgeous love 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 the distinctive okay all right moving on in bloom oh, so this one's in our january to june mini catalog and so i was really happy that it is um staying because it is a gorgeous gorgeous set i love these very fun very fabulous but the pierced blooms are the the dyes are so awesome so awesome look at those I like the stitched it said stitch is really in look how pretty that is ah! and it has a little fun bow you can make with the your paper so pretty i love these these dyes are so gorgeous this is a really fabulous you're amazing happy birthday um congrats it's kind of bold and lovely super nice super nice photopolymer and i do have a couple of samples here is one that i made with the pierce can you see all the pierced those blooms are so pretty and this is a blackberry bliss it's so dark and then um Teresa gave me these lovely ones that she made. Um, isn't that awesome? It stamps so beautifully. So pretty. See that? This is what that, um, this, um, what is that one called? It's like ornate flowers, embossing folder, that stayed. Unfortunately, the ovals have gone away, but oh, it's a really pretty. Um, I put my embossing folders away yesterday. And that means I had to put my, um, the old world map and the settles. The settles was my favorite. And so I was really sad that I actually had to put it away. But um, I, couldn't, I didn't want to mix it up. And then you get so many you can't find what you're looking for. So I had to put them away. It was very sad. I'm still keeping them, though. They're, they're just in a different section. <laughs> but isn't that pretty? This is just a gorgeous, lovely set. Perfect for spring. So beautiful. I love the one. Um, you guys see the that is such a really lovely um label oops that's the pansies i set the wrong thing down right here that pretty so nice i love all the stitching all the stitching so if you love stitching this one has all the stitching oops i put my thing too far away so i can set these down over here when i'm done okay next card so we have a new um light-hearted which is really a funny plot twist that when nothing goes goes uh right go left yeah everything is figure outable this is a super cute um word set and then of course our dress to impress which i love and i am going to do a project with this with to make the purse that goes with it is so fabulous I, I couldn't find it i had one that i had made but i couldn't find it um, but I did make some cards. So this one I made with using the note cards. Um, we have those fabulous very vanilla and um, basic white note cards that comes with envelopes. Not pretty. And um, I made my own DSP. So I made my own DSP using the um, these images. And it, they turned out really cute. Hello, fabulous. Love, love, love. And then here is... Um, another one. Now we no longer have this DSP or that um, that ribbon, but it does give you an idea of one of the things you can do with this super fun set. But like I said, the dies are my favorite part of the set, and it is again a photopolymer. The dies, oh my goodness! So I can't, I couldn't find my my purse. I don't know where it went. But here's the dies that cut out the images. And it has a nice um, like a little pocket piece because it makes it's one of those ones that will make look there's little buttons and buckles so it will make a little bag purse it's super cute super cute love 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 the, the all dressed so they don't earn in a bundle but you can still get them they're still available pretty awesome okay do to do and then the ice cream bundle um is not the ice cream is not in a bundle it's now in a bundle if you get it in the January to June mini catalog. But the stamp set in, and the punch both are carrying over, and um, which is awesome because it, it was out of stock for quite a while. It was on back order. But it's a great punch. As you guys see, you know, they've used this to make um, the Disney, 
the um, Mickey Mouse. Super cute. There's all kinds of fabulous things you can do with this punch. But it is a fabulous set. I love this happy birthday and thank you. They're a really nice, big, bold um, set. And here I did one. And again, the paper and this ribbon are available now still um, in the January to June catalog. Um, and I used the punch up. And so are these sprinkles. Well, I think the sprinkles just went on back order. But they're not in this catalog. They are in the January to June. And so you still have a month about a month and a half before things go back to the to we'll have another retiring list and there'll be while supplies us unfortunately the, the stitch nested labels that it, it went away the last time we have a couple of new um measure of love which is kind of cool with cupcakes you guys see that that's pretty awesome and another um brew some sun uh brew some fun with it's got like a little teacup and cup that's super cute right I love love. You can see they have some really great samples of that. And then the other cooking set we have is What's Cooking. And that's really fun. Especially if you've got somebody that was really into um, baking, even, um, and, or cooking. It's super cute. Um, here is the Simply Su Succulents stamp set. And that one is also from the January to June mini catalog. And what's really cool about this set is here I have a card that I made with it. Because I really love the, the dies, again, are um, fabulous with this. So let me pull out the dies. This is the stamp set, and it is red rubber. But the dies are um, 13 dies. But one of them is huge. One has a big, a big die. See that? Do do do. And you can make a um, fabulous, like a. See, she. This is another one that Teresa made for me, and it just fits over top of you. You can cut your cardstock out, and you can use this to make a mask, and then she used the blending brushes. You can see how pretty that looks. So you can totally use that. So not only could you make um, something pretty to go on top of a card, but you also can make um, something so you can do, um, make it as a mask. Isn't that cool? Super awesome. And again, I love these. Love, love, love those label dies. Very pretty. Love, love, love. Okay. So that's fantastic. And it is a cute thanks, too. I really like the thanks. It's in this one, too. Okay. Let's see. Do, do, do. Ice cream set. Um, we have another, fa we have a couple of good, um, really big, bonded um, sets that for sentiments. This one I really like because it's got that amazing and create. Um, that's a really awesome one. And then this is the Lovely You that we've had in a couple of catalogs. I did, it was paired with the label, um, with the Lovely Labels, which is in this catalog in the punches. Um, it's not a bundle, but they still have it. I love that one. And here is, this is one that I made last year for, um, to show off the in colors. I think we, this is one of the samples that they actually had in the catalog. And what's in, they had, we used to have like that gold, um, it was like a gold and it like a uh, ribbon. I can't remember if it was called trim, but it came apart really easily. We have new in here that's with the elegant. Um, so you can actually make this card, but with the, the simple trim. So it's like cord, but it's not as much cord. I'll definitely show you guys more of this when we get to the simply said, um, ele elegantly said, um, I love this. I love the just because it's really my favorite, but um, it's a fun, it's a fun, versatile set. And then of course, um, Daisy Lane is still in, which I love. And it has the two coordinating punches that you can get also with those. You have two punches, the medium and the Daisy punch, which are pretty awesome. Um, we still have the tu timeless tulips and it's a distinctive. Um, and here is a sample of that. That's a really pretty tulips. It's such, such a pretty, and, um, it has a lovely happy Mother's Day. Um, so if you've got this one, this is a good one to add to make a Mother's Day card, even though that's on Sunday. And it has a great, um, get well and happy Easter. So it was a really pretty, really lovely set. And then we have an, an, another new, um, sunny, sunny sentiments. That's really pretty. Um, hoping your birthday is filled with all the best things. 
So that's a really nice one. And then we also on the side have a sharing sunshine where you can make um, sunshine. It looks got like little smiles. Make them it's super cute for moon and sun. Right there. Um, this one is a banner one, the re retirement. Best chapter. The best chapter of your life is about to begin. Um, so they have the fabulous, like, congrats, a happy retirement, congratulations, happy wallet, wedding day, welcome to parenthood. You're strong, brilliant, and beautiful. Relax, eat, travel, indulge, read, enjoy, retire. So that's a really cute set that you can use. It's kind of versatile for uh, multiple occasions, not just for retirement. Um, here's a cute little uh, make it happen. Get crafty. I do like the get crafty. That's pretty fun. Um, and then here is uh, Bunches of Fun, which is, uh, it says Bunches of Fun, and that puppy dog does not look like he's having fun. He's got a cone, which is actually kind of cute, and it's a feel better soon. Um, and, and then it goes, um, on the brighter side, you don't need a cone, so that's kind of cute. Oh, if you're looking for fun sayings, that one definitely does have some. Um, the Many Happenings and Many Messages. So I don't know if you guys saw that this one was in the mini catalog the January to June, and I did get the mini messages, and the mini messages um, is one big stamp. So keep that in mind when you guys are getting these, they're one big stamp, and the die is one big die, and so you want to definitely, I know some people try to cut theirs, I did not try to cut these apart, the butterfly ones I totally did, but these ones I didn't, um, and they work really nice, and I just stamp them and put them in a case, and have them of uh, those sentiments on hand ready to go. And we have another new, and it, it did really well. I think it was one of the top sellers. So um, they have a newer one that's the many mess, the many happenings. So it has the year awesome, um, happily ever after, bundle of joy, and um, friends forever loves and hugs. So it fits the same die as the many messages. And it'll be one big stamp, like the mini messages. And, ooh, the strawberry the strawberry bundle. I don't know if that one is still, if it's still out or not. Um, but they have it has a fabulous punch. It went with that DSP that we had um, and the stamp set that was for celebrations. That was pretty cool. But it is a fun. And it has a very different type of font, which is a fun way to, like, shake it up. But it has a lovely hello there just for you. That was sweet of you. Super pretty. I do like do like the um although I think the small bloom punch um did retire, but um it's still super cute. Super cute. Love, love, love. Yeah, it just coordinates with that strawberry builder. So here is a new set. Now I didn't get this, it wasn't part of the pre-order. But if you like cats, this one you'll love. It's the Sweet in the Wild. And it, have, and it has DSP as well as an embossing folder that has like the cheetah print. And then it has two different kitties that you can make with it. Um, probably a tiger and a cheetah for both of them with extra spots and stripes as well as some foliage. And thanks, you're the beast instead of best. You are fierce. Hello, there for you always. So this is a super cute um, set, the Wildcats bundle. So you can get them both, both the dies and um, the cats. So that's pretty cool. That's kind of a fun, different, and it has an interesting color. Um, it's Mary Malo, Cajun Craze, Crush Curry, Soft Succulent, Evening Evergreen, and then the basic black. So it, um, it is a different kind of a color scheme, but it's super fun, right? Um, we have the um, a good man, which has been in. I think I think it was in last catalog. I did a series. I did these three images when we were doing the piece for piercing, and this is with that um, wood grain that's in the um, in good taste pack that actually did stay over. This uh, this one didn't. Um, the sentiment didn't, but the stitched rectangles did. But you can color them, and I colored them with the images with my blends. And then these are just the pearls, and I used the Knight of Navy um, blend to color the pearls, which worked out really well. Here is the other image. So super cute. I don't know what I did with the other one, but that's a fun set, especially for dads. We also have a cap, a new cap, the hats off bundle. 
you if you are into wearing hats and it has a lot of fun little um, patches that you can put on there um, super fun and it of course has um, die cuts so it is in a bundle as well and you know when you buy a bundle the dies and the stamp set together you save 10 percent which is pretty lovely i kind of love this set um the after the storm these clouds they just really speak to me and i really love the um these sentiments the font that they use it's so pretty you have been on my mind even the darkest night will pass and the sun will rise a little sunshine for your day just because i do love the just because it just looks so pretty i just really like the images on that and it has some lovely birds too um that's going to be one i am going it wasn't a part of our pre-order but it's definitely one that i'm going to get the handsomely suited is still like it's in the january june um catalog and so if this is when you want you want to get um the dies you can still get the dies in the bundle but it's in the january june catalog it is um it has also some DSP that matches. It's in the January to June. It's not in the in the catalog. But this is a great set for Father's Day too. Um, I mean, I really loved the the a good man set, but the suit and tie is pretty fabulous. Um, I'm sure you guys have seen lots of suit and tie um, coordinations, but these make um, the a super cool like tux jackets. And then it cuts out the tie, and it's got a pocket and. It has buttons and suspenders. It is a really fun set. Again, one I'm excited to use. I haven't got quite done as much. I think I made it, and then I, um, I've already sent the cards that I made with it out. Um, and then if you look at the top here on page 51, you can see like an example of those um, layering diorama dies. I can't wait to get those. That looks so cool. I really like really like the way they did that card that's going to be one i'm going to case from that as soon as i get those dies and then here's the sailing home which is a fabulous set we've had it in a while for a while and it has a great set of dies that match those um all of the um the images as well as it has a little bit of i love to make this put this into vellum um, like seaweed <laughs> i guess Kind of like what ocean um foliage and then it has this really great little banner it's super cute too so um you can see right here with the thanks that fits in it so this is a great set especially if you have somebody that likes the nautical stuff nautical theme stuff i have one this dsp is no longer available but you can see that that's um where i made with with that stamp and the, the coordinating die and then there's the boat is not pretty, and, the, and there's the wheel. So this is, and I, like I said, I love to use that with vellum. It makes such a great accent piece. Love, love, love that set. And that one is also distinctive, and it's sailing home. And then, ooh, the next one is, this is a part of a preset, but I didn't get this one, but my um, my friend Teresa did. It's the Inspire, Aspired Thoughts. And again, it comes in a bundle. And it has these gorgeous canopy um, tree dies and, um, and this fabulous word set. She did make me two cards to show you guys. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? So pretty. So it has the big die that cuts out the trees. And then it has also the littler dies that do um, the canopy. And here she put her, hers are laying down. But you can also use your... Um, paper piercer on your ticket on your ticket pick, pick take your pick tool and pop these up too if you want to give your um trees some more dimension even though it is quite since it's layered it does have some good dimension and then that isn't that pretty so pretty i love love okay and as you can tell right here see these clouds in the background so she used the new die border dies that are also um in the back first page right here the basic border dies and they have one that's the cloud and that's the one that she used and she um, cut it out and made the um, dies I actually right here behind me let's see what did I do with the envelope here we are so she actually um, they don't fit in your envelope here 
um, they don't really fit an envelope too much. You have to put it down lower if you want to add them to to an envelope. But she did stamp. And this, the DSP that she cut these out of, is that new pack of DSP that's in the back that's for Hostess. The, I think it's called Pattern Play. It's um, that you can get. It's that huge pack. Uh, yeah. Pattern Party, 12 by 12, 48 sheets, four of each sheet. So it's a ton of paper, a ton of paper. Here are some of the patterns. And they're, and those are like, they're colored on one side and they're black and white on the other. But they are stitched, these dies. So like, here's the cloud die. So she just did that on a piece of scrap and then used her blending brushes to make this. Um, let's see, she made the, moved it around over oh, right here like that. And used that to make, to make those pretty clouds. Isn't that gorgeous? So that's the edges. You can see the stitched, stitched edge on those. So those are pretty cool. So those, those are the, um, the border dies in the back, and um, this is called the Inspired Thoughts Bundle. So it's Inspired Thoughts stamp set and the Inspiring Canopy dies. So those are super cute, super cute. And then she, this is the oval punch. Very fabulous, very fabulous. And then up here is Nature's Beauty. Um, I've done a couple with the bunny. I think for Easter one year I did something with the bunny. This is a gorgeous set. I've got one, here's a, an older card, but I did find one that had um, this fabulous deer. Isn't that pretty? These are gorgeous that you can stamp either with your stays on on watercolor paper to watercolor them, these images, or you can um, use your memento and color them with your blends. Or even in the example here, they just show it with your, um, just stamping the color. Such pretty. And then here is the Campology, which is, um, if you're into camping, it's a nice one. We have the best, uh, a grandkid, a grandkid. I won't say it's the best because it says best oh, grandkid ever, but that's not the name of it. It's a grandkid. This is a fabulous Q set, even if you don't have any grandkids. Um, it has... I'm so proud of you. We must be related. You're so loved. Um, no much, no amount of money could ever show how much I love you, but here's some anyway, which is great if you're doing a gift card um, card. So that's a really cute words stamp set, sentiment stamp set. And then, of course, the cute pampered pets. So we, that's the one that the DSP went away, but I'm so happy that the, um, um, the dies and the stamp set stayed. And also we have the cat punch, though it's not not of the same. Um, but if you're looking for pets, we do have a very cute cat punch as well. But these dies are super cute. I love this little kitty. It's so pretty, so cute. Um, and then um, we have an ador wildly adorable. So there are some new baby sets in here that are pretty awesome. Um, look how cute, super cute. And um, oh, the turtles. These are not, of course, not on our pre-order, but oh, look how cute the, the turtle, and that is a, um, a punch, super cute. And then Stellar Birthday is also new. It is super cute. And um, I think I mentioned the Give It a Whirl dies that are in the back. It was one of the standalone dies. And that's, if you can see, they actually have an example of it on the, on the top of page 57, where they stamped the, the dog and the rocket and the ship um, not the ship, the rocket ship and the solar system, right? The planets. And you has the twirly wheel where you can twirl it. So that's kind of fun. And it's super cute, the puppy with the bone. <laughs> so that's a cute little kid set. Fabulous fun. And then we have a pirates and mermaids. I love that. I love the pirates and mermaids. And then again, it shows also at the top of page 58 how you can use your blending brush and your um, the decorative borders to make not decorative orders, the, oh, what are those called? Oops, I just dropped my, the um, masks, but they are, they have a new set of masks, stencils, I think that's what they're called, stencils, I, I don't know why that name, the word, like, it totally escapes me, and I was going to, I was trying to remember to mark it, I totally forgot, let me show you, where do those go? I love how they change everything and I can't you know, find it. It's going to take me a little while to get used to um, 
where all the things are. It's not all the same. Oh, here we go. So it's on page one, 128, and there's two, the decorative masks. That's why they are masks, but they're stencils. <laughs> so it's, um, um, you know, they're only eight bucks and you get four, four designs. And so we have a new, a new set this year, and that's the one that they showed with the, um, that looks almost like fish fins. That's the new one, and it is called Plenty of Patterns. So we have the basic patterns um, that we've had before, which has the lovely tree branches and a couple of the, the great shapes, the dots. Um, and then we have new ones, which are pretty awesome. So um, you can use the embossing paste, but it's also great to use with the blending brushes, which are pretty fabulous. Um, here's a new clean, clean set. Um, it's tiny like our itty bitty birthdays, um, but it's kind of a mix. Um, and the greetings, I love that set that I'm going to miss those three sets. So, um, but these are cute. The, and these are more like um, one happy family that kind of go with having a baby and having kids. So that's super cute. Has another, hey, there's smarty pants. And then here is more of a traditional uh, baby stamp set um, called All for Baby. And it has, you know, the, the onesie and the bib and the teddy bear and little feet, little hands, little hands, little feet, big love. So this is and congratulations on your growing family. That's super cute. And it does come in a bundle with coordinating dies. So um, that's a pretty super cute sweat. And oh, that's it. That is the end. Isn't that fabulous? So we have gotten through um, the set. I hope you guys enjoyed looking at these, especially that gorgeous, the gorgeous pansies. And like I said, the, the tutorial, a PDF on how to make these super cute and quick and easy. These are pretty easy um, tags using um, the new tailor-made tags. Are um, It's up on my website. And then I wanted to remember, too, when we were talking about the in colors yesterday, I wanted to mention, and I totally forgot, um, that, yes, this is where you can find the colors down here on the bottom of page 123. But if you go over to page... Um, 126 right these are our assortment and bundles so if we don't have any of if you don't have any of the um in colors and you want to buy them all and get um get them all at once they have the um the bundles there um also they have the um where you can get the assortment packs of the cardstock right there and that's where you can also get the markers so also in the color families and you can get the refills for the classic color families, but we individually you have to get the individual refills for the ink colors. And then they also have the, the Marvelous Markers, which is a huge pack of markers. And then if you find anything you need, definitely use my host code. I, like I said yesterday, I did get some of those in color jewels before they went on back order um, as my thank you um, for ordering $50 or more in my online store when you use the host code. So that's exciting. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed today's walkthrough for part two. And um, tomorrow will be join me again for part three at 1.30. So you guys have a great rest of your day. And happy crafting. Bye.